Lead containing particles and sediment can enter your home plumbing when a lead service line is replaced. But if you flush your home plumbing after the line is replaced, you will clear out these particles and prevent lead exposure. We'll show you how to flush your home plumbing step by step. First, make sure all your ice makers are turned off and all ice is dumped. Next, find all faucets and fixtures that have a drain and remove and clean the aerators. The aerator is a screen cap at the end of the faucet. Soak the aerator in vinegar for five minutes to dissolve residue and particles. If you have any filters installed on your faucets, remove those too. Now the fun begins. Go to the lowest level of your home and turn on the cold water at every faucet at a high flow rate. Make sure the water is draining properly before moving on to the next faucet. Leave the water running the lowest level and work your way up through your home, repeating these steps on every level. Once all the faucets are open, let the water run for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, shut off every faucet and fixture, starting at the lowest level of your home. Reattach the aerators, and you're ready to use the water again. Complete this flush every two weeks for three months after your water service line is replaced. Each flush will use about one unit of water, costing less than $4. For more information about home flushing, visit our website.